who can beat the pyramids? Who can beat Tutankhamun? Who can beat being in Egypt, the land where everything begins? The Grand Egyptian Museum is really a complete vision of ancient Egypt. Inside, you find a civilization of 7,000 years. Outside, you see a facade which is very contemporary and modern. General Latif Muftah led the construction work on the project. He knows by heart each and every corner of the museum to ensure that sustainability is taken into account. Its architecture is unique. Its location is unique. It's a fourth pyramid in Giza. It's a gift from Egypt to the humanity. When you enter, you find one of the biggest statues, the statue of Ramses II. And the size of the statue looks so small in the midst of the entrance of the museum. And that just gives scale to the project. It's more than 8,500 square meter. It's an open museum. You will have a huge panoramic view overlooking the pyramids. We cannot find a better place in the world to showcase this uh, unique heritage. This is the only museum that will include the full collection of Tutankhamun, 5,000 pieces. More than 2,000 of its collection will be displayed for the first time. We finished restoring now more than 45,000 objects. It's a very meticulous and uh, difficult work. The object conserved here uh, sometimes from 4,500 years ago. We find a lot about the techniques of the ancient craftsmanship, which is very exciting. Having the Grand Egyptian Museum opening by the end of 2020 is something that we're extremely proud about. It's one of the most famous uh, cultural projects in the world today. I believe that the Grand Egyptian Museum is going to be a place where people from all over the world can come, you know, open their mouth in awe all together. It is definitely uh, a project not just for Egypt, but for all of humanity. <laughs>